We have more live leaks of One UI 7.0 on our hands. From the new control center look to the icons and for the first time we see Samsung's version of Dynamic Island in action. Let's take a look at everything. Let's start with Samsung's implementation of Dynamic Island slash live activities. You can see the active notifications in the top left area, such as a stopwatch. When you touch it, you get an expanded version with additional controls. It's clear that this is very similar to Apple's implementation of Dynamic Island, which is known for its smooth animations. Hopefully, Samsung can match that, but it doesn't look quite the same from what we've seen so far. We'll know more when the actual update is out. Samsung's version works similarly to Apple's, but let me know what you think in the comments below. After last week's leaks of redesigned icons for some of Samsung's stock apps, there's a new leak from SmartPricks and ex-user Chun Bai showing more design changes in One UI 7.0. The images reveal One UI 7.0's new quick panel design and a more rounded overall look. The quick panel is now split into two sections, quick settings and notifications. You can switch between them by swiping left or right. You can also hide the labels of the quick settings. The new design is more like an improved version of the One UI 6.0 quick panel rather than something copied from iOS, as some rumors suggested. As shown in the screenshots, Samsung has updated the icons for several of its stock apps, including camera, clock, contacts, gallery, and weather. Samsung has also improved the continuity feature, which now lets users send video call notifications to nearby devices. This means you can continue regular or video calls from a Galaxy phone to a Galaxy tablet or a Samsung TV nearby, as long as both devices are signed in with the same Samsung account. Notifications now look more rounded and have more space between them. The Galaxy S24 Ultra will be among the first to receive the update, and there's good news. Samsung is working on significantly improving the camera experience. According to Ice Universe, One UI 7.0 will optimize several shooting modes for the Galaxy S24 Ultra. The source claims that the 1X and 5X 50 megapixel modes for the primary and telephoto cameras, respectively, will offer the same picture quality as Pixel Bin 12 megapixel photos. Capturing photos in the 12 megapixel Pixel Bin mode with the Galaxy S24 Ultra generally delivers better clarity, colors, and dynamic range. With One UI 7.0, the Galaxy S24 Ultra's 1X 50 megapixel primary mode and 5X 50 Megapixel telephoto mode are expected to match that level of detail and quality. Are you excited for the One UI 7.0 update? That's it for today. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.